here at the Wiener Prater and we are celebrating 13 years of freestyle in Vienna and you know if you don't do something really crazy then press doesn't really report they care about highlights gossips or fuck ups so we were looking for a highlight and um, Joyce then drove down from Norway and showed a huge backflip in front of the giant wheel in Vienna anyhow wind is our biggest enemy and we had a lot of wind and the difficulty was all the press here put a lot of pressure on Joisten, so I'm really happy everything worked out. He gassed it a lot, flat landed, but um, made it work. We got the money shot, like we say, and um, really pumped. It. We had like one minute with the almost silent, and then I tried to go for the backflip, and um, I go really fast into the ramp because of the wind, and then I go a little bit too far, but everything is okay. The show gonna be so much better than this. Yeah, a week till the first show, don't even tell me about it. I'm, I'm a nerve wreck. We're going to the remote office in the venue tomorrow. I'm also moving to the hotel because it sounds funny because we are from Vienna but you know these 20 minutes that you need to drive home and that you can get extra sleep or extra time it's actually worth gold so tomorrow we're already going to shoot in the city and um, people are loading in the venue already so it's showtime. We are pretty fast this year we start on Tuesday in the morning 7 and finish it at Wednesday at 3 o'clock. Probably the toughest part is the timing, you know, if you order the dirt to the right time and the machine and everything, so everything works out good and, and the riders have a perfect course to shred, you know. It's very important to, to have a 100% perfect setup today. The guys can show the biggest trick they have. We did some crazy stuff for this new MOD. Normally it's the horse that they, they pull, but this time bike, so it's, it's nice, it's crazy. We never tried before, but in the end we figured out how to do it, and I think we had a great shot. We are politicians, so we need to jump and ride in front of the parliament. That's, That's perfect. Putting our political uh, print down on uh, Wien. <laughs> and the police was here, couldn't say anything, and that's a really good feeling. Thank you, Sean. And we're here, still in front of the city hall, still no commission, and um, BNV is just gonna hopefully front flip this little natural bench. It's gonna be pretty sick, I'm excited. Many double front flips this weekend, so don't worry. We're in Wien Dobona, it's an indoor skydiving place in Vienna. You know, riding dirt bikes for a lot of, uh, long time, whatever, doing a lot of crazy stuff, but I've always been a bit nervous of skydiving. So getting that feeling was very surreal, I must say, I feel like a kid, to be honest. I want to learn that. It's such a good feeling. Practice now, uh, always scary, whoever tries to jump first, but I'm ready for the task this year and help all the boys over it. Then we're gonna have a big sesh till 12. The setup this year is insane, man. Like, it's super safe, super smooth, and uh, the second landing is soft, which makes us allowed to send it. I want to give new people a chance, so we made a ticket to ride contest. Dream come true, definitely. Like, can't describe the words how happy I am to be here. We're Marcus Christopher, a 13 year old machine from the States. He was uh, shaking up the roll in before hitting the jumps for the first time, which I understand so, so well. All right, ready, dude? Yeah. Fuck yeah, let's do it. Ready? Woo! Yeah, boy! Yeah. 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 It's 
13, started riding bikes when he was four. Um, got the invite to come out to uh, Austria this year for Masters of Dirt. He was confident that he could handle it, and uh, we're at practice right now. Dudes are just great guys. Um, treated Marcus very well. He feels comfortable. He's now uh, in the family. Got into the show spirit, and uh, yeah, feeling a little punk. And went for a fresh nut with my man the barber here. And he's pretty awesome. I think everyone's stoked and wants to go now. I crash pretty hard. <laughs> I want to ride. That's why I'm here. Oh! The first time in Austria with the buggy. I managed one flip in practice, pretty happy, after Dubai, first one. I decided to send all my tricks here and even practice some new moves. And then uh, relax for the rest of the day, take some photos, do all the behind the scenes stuff that you, you never see. Getting ready for Masters of Dirt dinner, welcome dinner. Dressing up like, with our seven euro shirts and stuff. So we're going all out. We've got the shoes to match the teeth. We're gonna bling it, let's bling it, let's live life to the fullest, let's go all out, that's what I see it. If every event did that and uh, had everyone get dressed up nice and uh, take them to dinner, I think it just changes it. It makes it fun and makes everyone want to go out and enjoy the night and especially before a big event. We did all we can to make your weekend the weekend, the big weekend of the year again. Especially Arthur, who is all, of course still in the venue. Yeah, now it's up to you to make it um, to make the show as good as possible. Because it's fucking MOD time. I think the city of Vienna has always got behind Masters of Dirt for the last 13 years. This is MOD home base, this is where we are from and this is for sure the biggest show in the world. It is always completely stressful. I mean everybody is freaking out on this one. You're looking forward to the moment when you start the show, when you press play and when you know that people are gonna be stunned. And this is the moment that we work on the entire year. The adrenaline that I feel when I do the presentation with the drummer, with Mozakian and stuff, it's incredible. And to see all the fire around and, and take in the arena is incredible. It seems like every year they put me higher and higher, now I'm uh, 10 meters above the ground. The guys do crazy tricks, I can maintain it and try to beat it. My scare of height. MOD is not just one of my gig, this is part of my life. Having the drummers go off on the intro and also at the, at the fire show, that, that's really cool for me. And then you drop in for the first time and the crowd gets super rowdy and cheers. And then you get this like goose skin, goosebumps. You know, when you've got like uh, 7,000 people in the crowd going crazy, you obviously really feed off that. The crowd here is just very into it, very loud, and it just gives us like that more motivation to, to go out and, and ride our best. That Tron thing with the LED suits, where we had the blackout and then uh, wow, sh all of a sudden the track lights up. It's a show, but it showcases all of us riders having fun doing what we love. There's no pressure whatsoever. Everyone is doing the craziest thing right after another. So this is just non-stop craziness. 
They're all the best at what they do and they're all gnarly, you know? It's time to send it tonight. For Adolf, I think it was the best show ever. He just wants to go big and he just wants to land tricks that he's never done before and that no one's ever done before, basically. That banger, Nicole just changed my mind. It's a crazy spin, it's a crazy rotation, and I never really know where I am at uh, at any point of it. That guy is it's not human, no, it's a machine. So many athletes and so much uh, happening around it. The best weekend in my life, yet again, MOD Vienna killed it, the mother of all shows. The parties. Whew, where do you begin about the parties? Parties. I'm a good girl. I never party. Uh, look, like you hear on my voice, the party was great, like always, like. We destroy, we, we do crazy stuff, all the t-shirt gone, and uh, we put something good to the people that they were there. Excuse me. Uh, that's from the party. <laughs> the best parties in the world. There's no other event in BMX you go to where just as important as the riding is, the partying is that important. Thanks everyone for coming out from every corner of the world. It's my childhood dream become true. I almost get horny when I see you guys ride. You are my idols. You will always be. Biggest respect to everything you do out there. I wish I could do it like this. But hey, my dream became true and um, Let's kill it another year. Masters of what? Masters of what? Masters of what? Masters of what?